G'day viewers, welcome to the Goat Shed. Today is Saturday the 14th of September and here we are with Graham and Spanky yeah. at Club Macquarie located in Newcastle, New South Wales for our annual Pin Fest. Now this is just a quick overview of the room. It's quite a big room, so we're just going to show. Um, we've got a whole heap of machines up one wall, down the other side, right across here, over through here, down here. Most important, a bar over there. And right behind me here, we've got some old pre-war pre, pre -war stuff. Really old stuff from the Australian Pinball Museum, located in Nil in Victoria. Here's a uh, Singapore. Uh, what's that? Uh, who made that? United, did they, Graham? Yep. yep. And we've got a King Arthur um, wood roll, which is really cool to have. And we've just bought a... Um, the guy forgot to bring his step-down transformer, so we've bought that. And they have a few exhibits of circuit boards and flipper units and various other stuff. There's some drop targets. Oh, we'll need one of them. There's a relay valve. <laughs> feel free to take it. I don't think the guy will care. Um, so let's just go for a quick walk around here and have a look at all the electromechanicals, which is what we're all about anyway. Um, it's another quarter hour and this place opens. So here's El Dorado. Those of you that follow us will have just seen that in the goat shed, along with Surfer, which we've just had in. There's a jet spin here for sale or trade, 3,000 bucks. That's not bad for an Australian price. Here's Jumping Jack, we just had that in the goat shed. That had a really bizarre problem. Um, we didn't do a video on that, but the score reel would fire when you reached nine when you were manually turning it around. But it turned out someone had wired the ender stroke switches they got the for the carryover to the nine and the ender stroke back to front. So that was interesting. So you got two fires of the from 100 to 1,000. It fired on night. Nine and zero. Uh, here's a Gottlieb Pioneer. Try and not too bad. Not sure who owns this. Don't know that we've seen it. Here's a Wildlife for sale. Um, okay. Uh, we had a very quick look at that yesterday. Not too bad, but it's got like the no artwork on the side. Oh, here's a dropper card. Um, my god, so we've got a dropper card coming into the goat shed. I don't, it's not this one, I don't believe, is it? It is this one. It is this one. Yeah. Okay, it's going to get a whole play field redo. So that's coming, that's coming to the goat shed straight after Pinfest. This Pinfest goes today and tomorrow. Oh, all righty, oh, here you go. Um, so the owner is, is getting that play field done up. Oh, here's a pat hand, I don't know who owns that. I don't think we've ever seen that, have we, Graham? No. Ah, Klondike. Now here's a Williams Klondike, pretty good game, based on what the Gold Rush days. Got the slot machine reels up the back, like Full House and a couple of other games. And a classic Norm Clark design. I hope you can all hear me, we haven't got the external microphone on today. Um, here's Magic City. Um, have to find out what happened to the keys on this. Um, that's my game. Oh, look at that. Someone started the game. This is what you've got to look out for. They start a game and they don't um, They don't fire the first ball, especially push-up balls. Now, here's a Chicago Coin Casino. Now, you wouldn't see too many of those. Um, that's a little bit of a blurb, electromechanical update. Um, yeah, wow. Um, double spinners. Double spinners. Um, where are we? Where are the double spinners? Yeah. Oh, them went things. Yeah, that's right. A bit like on that, um, what did you call it we had? Yeah. 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 Um, and here's the, um, here's a Captain Fantastic. This turns up every year. It's in really, really good condition. Um, the owner of this has had it for quite a long time. Uh, Graham and I had done this several years ago. So, um, yeah, it's a um, really nice machine. 
So that's about a lot of the electromechanicals. Um, and we come over to the other side here and we'll give you a quick look. Um, now this is a guy, this guy makes his own machines, custom built machine, don't panic. Um, there it is there. Um, there's another one of his creations. Um, so we've got a few other games all along here. I'm only going to run through these very quickly just to give you a bit of an idea of what's going on. Um, I know on the video all the flashing lights don't look real good. There's a, there's a great old Adams family. Medieval Madness, Lethal Weapon. Quite a few. Black Lagoon. Um, just next to uh, Captain Fantastic, we had the Iron um, Man. There we go. Come up here. Uh, what have we got? Uh, oh, Battle Pinny. This is a custom made thing, I think. Seems to turn up every year. Um, dual heading game. Here's a Hankin Orbit 1. Now, any of you people may know that Newcastle, where we live, was the home of A. Hankin and Company. They were in Derby Street in Newcastle. So there's one of their creations. And here's a rare one. This, this is a this rare is, one, Graham? This is a Ruth and the Kiss. Valley Kiss. Oh, okay, all right. Let's have a quick look at this. Um, well, back in the day, before the kisses were flogged out, the place was okay. really bad. The backlasts started the pool, so some um, company made complete um, games to a new play field overlay and a back class. Right, okay, what have we got here, robot? Okay, let's have a look. Couple of unlikely characters there. Say hello to our viewers all over the world. Thank you very much. Um, okay, we're just going to rush through these. We're getting very close to opening time. Indiana Jones, Corvette, Defender, yeah, Williams, yeah. Okay, excuse me. You can see the names for yourselves, viewers. Centaur. Here's a popular old game. Valley game. Harlem Globetrotters. Then on. First machine with the female talking. Oh, right. Okay. Gee, we've got a, quite a lot of games out here. Um, there's over 100 games here, people. Uh, this time. Yeah. Well, just... Um, we'll just give you a quick look up there and what I want to do now I want to take you out to another room um, oh first of all oh here's Elton John that's relatively new isn't it okay and then all up here we have um, a whole other row of machines Quite a lot. Okay, let's turn around. Oh, he's Spanky at the bar. Oh no, he can't help himself. Dear me. Yeah, I think we're going to have to take him to AA, Graham. Um, here we are. This is who who we are. The the Newcastle Pinball Association. Uh, this is the longest running pinball show in Australia. Uh, this, in fact, is the thirteenth year. 13th year of Pinfest. Um, okay, so we're going to come into the other room here. Um, here's where they sell the uh, the t-shirts and all the other stuff. Yeah, there's all the punters getting ready to come in. They're about 10 minutes off coming in. Um, let's have a look here. Um, this is all the generally all the new machine vendors are in here. Ah, oh, where's that? Okay. So, this is the new Peter Brock machine. Um, I'm afraid I can't... Oh, Vector Pinball. Here you go. Um, now, you'll have to forgive me. I don't know much about this, except that it's... A lot of people in America would know about Peter Brock. Yeah. Peter Brock was a famous racing car driver here in Australia in the Bathurst we have regularly and tragically got killed in Tasmania when he hit a tree in a rally. Um, so we've got an 8-ball Fury here. 
from the same people. Um, like I say, their name seems to be Vector. Uh, oh, here's their business card here. Let's have a quick look. Whoops, that's them there. Um, original custom license, Jason. Jason, there you go. There's his email address if you want to talk to him. I've got a good report about this guy. Okay, right, okay. Uh, here's the, another Peter Brock game here. And then over here we have Foo Fighters. Oh, okay. Um, oh, Dr. No. Right here. James Bond theme game. Any James Bond aficionado would know that Dr. No was the first of the series in 1962. And we have Godzilla. A couple of those here with Deadpool. Um, what, about, what else we got here? Jaws. Who makes Jaws? Got no idea. Oh, there you go. See? Venom. Alright, what else we got? No, we've got a camera on one. What's this? Oh, dear me. Yeah. What else we got? What's this thing? John Wick. Oh, here we go. Hey, uh, Cliffy. All the way from North. All, all the way from far north Queensland. Oh, Dave, I mean, yeah. Wrong one. Anyway, never mind. Uh, what have we got over here? Um, yeah. Okay. Um, all right, viewers, that's about it. Um, as I said, the punters are due to arrive here any minute. Um, so... Tomorrow it's only two weeks till I end up over in the States, so we're looking forward to catching up with everyone over and um, seeing you all again. Uh, not that far away. So there's Graham with Spanky. Um, he got him away from the bar. Oh no, he's, he's drunk, he fell over. Okay, all right viewers, that's just a quick tour of our Pinfest uh, annual event. All the money we raise here goes to charity and we're expecting a record year this year. Uh, this year um, a mob's getting it who sort of help out the homeless and people doing it tough. Um, for the life of me I can't remember their name but needless to say um, that's what's going on. So thanks so much for watching. We'll see you later.